Hi, this is Joe and welcome back to the shop. Uh, we're going to be doing some uh, quick and dirty measurement techniques. I have a piece of square tube here I have to reproduce. It's from a fire pit base that uh, rusted out. So I have a, a block of wood, a piece of string, a tape measure, and a felt tip marker. By moving the block of wood back and forth or the, uh, uh, the radius curved square tube, I'm trying to get uh, an exact measurement. As you see, I'm uh, moving it back and forth, and one end is a little longer than the other. So by uh, moving the block of wood back and forth, in and out, I can then, uh, when the string is exactly following the radius, I can uh, take that, measure it. Uh, as you see here, I already made a uh, rolled a piece of a flat bar to duplicate that radius. So you basically take the radius, you double it to your diameter, and then you can measure out uh, and roll your uh, piece of tubing, or uh, in this case, a piece of flat bar. And then I can make uh, my brackets uh, for, the, uh, for the fire pit ring. Uh, here I have uh, two concentric rings. I made a base out of wood uh, at the proper height. I took some chalk laid out uh, the inner circle and the outer circle. And then using a square, I can now align the uh, upper ring with the lower ring in preparation for tack welding of the, uh, the braces between the upper and lower ring. So it uh, works out really well. It took me a few minutes uh, uh, to uh, put together the uh, pieces of wood on the base. And now I can uh, sort of pre-fit the uh, the brackets to go between the, the rings. Uh, when that's done, then I can go ahead and uh, uh, use some vice grips, clamp them, and then tack weld uh, the braces into position. And uh, then I have a pretty uh, concentric circles for my rings. Another uh, situation here is I want to do a uh, screened cover for the fire pit. So I rolled some quarter inch rod, and I want to cut that into a half and then one piece into quarters. So I measured uh, from a, a line on my concrete floor to get an exact straight line. Then I can take uh, and measure the uh, width of the ring and draw another uh, straight line. And then all I have to do is take my square and measure uh, exactly half of that put some marks on the uh, cement floor. Then I can take my square and mark uh, exactly half of that. And uh, where you see the vice grips at the very top, that uh, is just held together. So when I mark those, I'll have an exact half circle. And then two quarters, which I'll then use and tack weld them to the base of the, uh, the top ring of the fire pit. So uh, hope you enjoyed this. Uh, just a couple couple things that I do to do some quick and dirty measuring when I'm in the field or doing some quick fabrication uh, makes life easy. Uh, hope you enjoy the uh, video and uh, please check back for more. I'll be doing some more videos uh, here in the coming weeks. Thanks a lot and hope you enjoyed it.